What's up guys, my hair in case performance. Uh, today we're doing a quick Haldex uh, oil filter change on our very own meth machine. Uh, the process is quite simple, um, but it can be quite a difficult task if you do not have VAG comp. So as you can see, I've already got the oil filter popped out hard up, up against the, uh, the end cap. So what we do is we use VAGCOM, we go to address 22, which I believe is the all wheel drive system, and then we just do a simple output test on the, the pre-charge pump. And all that'll do is it'll push that filter out. So I'll try and get my hands in there so you can see what we're on about. So you've got, hang on, my magic favorite screwdriver. You've got the end cap here. And then you've got, oh, the lost focus, there we go. So you've got the little O-ring here. There's two O-rings on that little end wad that sort of sits in between. It's like a, a sub-seal unit for the oil filter. So you've got the end cap here and there. So we'll back these off and then get an idea of how long the thread is and then bung it in about five, five or six turns, whatever you like, enough just to create a bit of a gap and then go in through the address 22 all-wheel drive, do a simple output test on the pre-charge pump. That'll then pop out and then you just grab the rest of that with a your favorite pliers whatever you like and then just pop in the new one so easy peasy jump and easy and uh, then obviously we have the uh, there we go difficult trying to point to something through a camera uh, we've got the, uh, the actual motor here for the pump so there's a little strainer in here we're going to be taking those two bolts off there and we'll be uh, getting the strainer out of there giving it a clean uh, typically, Volkswagen Adi Group don't give you a service part number for that. You have to get that separately. Uh, I got mine off eBay, like 45 quid or something like that. Um, they will not be they will not be replaced under Volkswagen or Audi Group dealerships because they simply don't have a part number for it. So you can pretty much guess that they don't have a procedure for it either. But it is a filter. Filters do clog up, so you need to put in them and replace them. The Mark One. Uh, Haldex was quite a good system because it was oil every 20,000 miles and uh, an oil filter every 40,000 miles. So, and they had the service part numbers for it. Bit of an awkward cunt to get to on the, the first generation. I believe this is the fourth generation. So it's simple enough to do, guys. All right, cheers, Mike.